In this demonstration, I'll show you how to find the equation of a line that is parallel to a line passing through a point. The question reads, find the equation of the line parallel to y is equal to negative 3x plus 4 over 9 that passes through the point negative 2 and 7. To be successful in this question, you'll need to know the following formula. y is equal to mx plus b. And this is the skeleton or the template of an equation that represents a line. This m value right here represents the slope. And you'll notice that the m value is always connected to the x. In other words, that m value is always being multiplied to the x. This b value right here represents the y-intercept. That is the point where the line crosses the y-axis. The x and the y represent your independent and dependent variables. The question asks us to find an equation of a line that is parallel. Lines are parallel when their slopes are the same. Because of that, our new equation, which they're asking us to find, has to have a slope of negative 3. So our m value for our new line will equal to negative 3. Let's fill in this value into our formula. y is equal to negative 3x plus b. The next thing that they tell us is that it passes the point negative 2 and 7. This negative 2 right here represents your x, and this positive 7 represents your y, your independent and dependent variable. So in your next step, you will substitute this 7 and this negative 2 into y and x. Let's go ahead and do that. 7 will be replaced with y, negative 3, bracket, negative 2, plus b. In case you're curious as to why I added these parentheses, it is because I'm substituting a value that is being multiplied to another. Notice that I also substituted 7 into y, but I didn't add parentheses. That's because it's not being multiplied to anything. So let's go ahead and evaluate the right side here. Evaluate means to multiply it out. What we have is negative 3 times negative 2, which is equal to positive 6, plus b. And on the left side, you have 7. 6 plus b doesn't give you anything, so you'll have to rearrange the right side. And the way you do that is you bring the 6, which is currently positive, over to the left side. 7 minus 6 is equal to b. On the left side, 7 minus 6 is equal to 1. 1 is equal to b. So now that you found all the elements that you need, you can create an equation. y is equal to negative 3x plus 1. And there you have it. That is how to create an equation of a line that is parallel to another line passing through a random point. If you found this tutorial helpful, please support our channel by subscribing or by liking this video. If you have any further questions, you may visit our website at studyforce.com. We are an online service for students seeking free homework help. See you soon.